We're getting closer and closer to the arrival of Big Run, which is going to be one of the biggest events we've seen in Splatoon. We even got an announcement for Big Run this weekend, so it feels like everything is really ramping up. Aside from what we already know, Nintendo did confirm that Big Run will actually be a random weapon rotation by the looks of things, and that it'll work just like the others that you get probably twice a month in the regular mode. That means that during Big Run, any weapon, including the new ones, should become available to use. We will even see a special Grizzco weapon, which will be the Grizzco Blaster, as confirmed by Oatmeal Dome over on Twitter. However, another datamine will actually be the main focus of this video, because it confirms that we won't be seeing certain special waves during this big run event. Over on Twitter, DiamCreeper24 says, From some testing, big run seems to only allow some night waves to occur. Specifically, only Glowfly Rush, Fog, Gorillas, and the Mothership appear at work. Now, if you remember, we have actually seen these confirmed during the trailer for Big Run that we got at the start of the chill season. Some people have been speculating which of the special waves we're going to see, especially as this is happening on Wahoo World, which would need some significant modifications for every single special wave to work. Continuing on, Dime Creeper says, Kohok Charge, Goldie Seeking, Mud Mouth Eruptions, and Giant Tornado seem to not all appear nor work properly if forced. So effectively, they've tried to get these working in Big Run and it's just not possible. And there's a few reasons for why this happens. For a start, with stuff like Goldie Seeking and Mud Mouth Eruptions, the stage doesn't have proper gushes for the creatures to come out of. That means that they would have had to add more of these to this stage in order for it to work as intended. And it really does seem like honestly Nintendo hasn't made that many changes to Wahoo World in order for it to work as a Salmon Run stage. It really is the Turf War and other mode stage that we already know. Of course, Kohok Charge and Giant Tornado won't work because there isn't really a deep, low tide like we've seen on most of the Salmon Run stages. Once again, this is just a maybe slightly modified Wahoo World, so it doesn't really have anything like that. During the stage, we can see the different tides in action, but it's much more subtle than what we usually have. In Big Run, you'll basically just be working from the center area of Wahoo World, so there's not going to be as much opportunity for things like a really low tide. Personally, I do think it's a bit of a shame. In my opinion, they've taken away all of the kind of like free night waves that I really like. These ones tend to be a lot easier for gathering eggs. I don't think that's why they took them away though. Like I said earlier, there are some more valid reasons, but hopefully in future big runs, they may modify the stages even more so that all of these extra modes can work properly and be a part of the big run. Still, it is going to be an incredibly fun event. If you missed my other video about Big Run bonuses, we do know now that you will get a catalogue bonus for taking part, which is really exciting. So it should be a little bit easier to level up your catalogue during this time. It does seem like we will also get extra capsules as well, which is great. Although they haven't mentioned anything yet about extra rewards from King Kohozuna, and I haven't seen anything data mined about that either. So if you were hoping to get extra scales from Big Run, it certainly doesn't seem like that is the case at the moment, unfortunately. Either way, keep in mind that a lot of these tougher modes like glow flies and gorillas and such will be a part of it. So now might be a good time to head on over to YouTube, which I guess you're already on if you're watching this video, and check out some guides on how to tackle these waves properly. Big Run is going to be a big collaborative effort, so everyone's got to try their best. But let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. Are you sad that these special night waves will not be a part of Big Run as far as we know? Or do you think maybe it's a good thing in some ways? I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comment section below. If you made it to the end, be sure to comment Grizzco Gang down below so I know that you did. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and turn on channel notifications for more.